2017 Ram 2500 Laramie Cummins. Boom. Those puppies are going on now. Check this banner out, guys. <laughs> that is sweet. man hello and welcome back to the channel today is the day i told him not to wash it today is the day that everybody's been waiting for we're finally returning back to our roots right hetty that's right picking up something new something big well hetty's got it on there already what, what? what's that what's that kylie yeah, what is that what is that i think it i think it's a truck wait yeah, I think I think Chase is it's a mega cab. I don't know. Could that be ours? Is that ours head? No, I don't know. Is, is that, that ours? ours? Probably have to see what the tag says. Oh yeah. Yeah. Let's go find a parking spot. You guys haven't figured it out already. We're at uh, Jeff D Ambrosio Auto Group of Downingtown, Pennsylvania. I told you. What's that say? I told you <laughs> this vehicle was built especially for Beast Projects. I told you. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, look at all the room back here, Kylie. Look at all that room. It smells good. It smells good. It smells like Windex. <laughs> Jesus, going to be mad. But I mean, so I don't have to have him. He's still going to have to do a thorough clean. Oh my gosh, yeah. yeah. Got him. See, he's sitting in there. These things, when they come off the railroad, they have a ton of uh, railroad dust on them. Railroad? What's a railroad? Railroad. Yeah. Oh. Mexico. Train, and then it went on a truck. It ran on a train. Mm -hmm. So as you see, guys, we went with brand boxes. I thought these would be cool because we're always like, I'm always throwing stuff over the back of the bed in the old truck. Hey, what's that? And these are these are Ram boxes. No, I don't that. That's in case you get stuck in there, you can get out. Yeah. yeah, just in case you get stuck in there, you can get out by pulling this tab. You keep it in cold seats. It's got the Laramie um, equipment group uh, type two or level two. So it's got like all the the bells and whistles that you could possibly think of. You know, aluminum brushed door sills. 
I mean, I, I can go on and on, guys. You got your, you got your wireless charging for your phone down there. I'm still probably gonna get a pro clip with that. Oh yeah, sold Beast Projects. I can talk for hours and hours. I'm like, I'm probably like giddy. I'm like a little kid in school right now. Um, is that? What, I can't even. <laughs> Going nuts! I can't even talk. I'm stuttering over my words. Oh my god! I'm like I'm like a little kid right now, guys. I'm I'm ecstatic. I want to drive this a little bit and talk about it a little bit more and and why I expect the certain things out that I did. Um, but yeah, it's also got the towing upgrade. Uh, I don't know. I, I can't even talk. I can't even talk right now. When are we uh, <laughs> picking my boat up? Yeah, we're gonna. No, we gotta get a trailer so we can trail a Ruby Beast different places. Unfortunately, <laughs> the footage at the dealership, I had mic issues. I took the actual windsock off my mic thinking, you know, it might be a little bit better, less directional. Well, it failed. It actually crackled, popped, and uh, a lot of my footage, I lost it. So I just want to go over the new build for the channel. Very excited. It's, I've been driving it for about two weeks now. I'm um, going to give you all the details. I actually ordered this. I got the actual order sheet right here. Um, ordered this back in July, uh, July 27th of uh, 2020 during the summer. And we got it about two weeks ago. And I spec this truck out completely myself with everything that I wanted. The only thing I did slip up that I didn't order, which I think is the cold, uh, not the cold weather group, but the um, plow group which comes with the auxiliary switches. That's the only thing I didn't get that I wish I would have. Other than that, this thing is, it's got absolutely everything that I wanted. I still haven't even had an opportunity to get Chase to clean this and go over it, because we're gonna ceramic coat it too. Because that's what you do when you get a brand new truck. But I love this granite crystal metallic. It's, I love it. It's gray. It's got a very, very nice flake in it. It's uh, it's gonna look super clean. We're gonna get it. I mean, it's not too clean right now, guys, but it's gonna be clean. We're gonna get it coated. Um, again, Chase and Karen will be out here tomorrow doing that. Not not ceramic coating, just going over it. We'll be doing that. We'll be doing a video on that. Um, I'm making another video after this video already with Dirty Diesels because, well, <laughs> if you guys remember, I don't wait. I don't wait. When we get a new truck, we just go. We go, 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 go. So, got some plans with Dirty Diesels. Look forward to those videos. But, uh, yeah, I just, um, I'm still kind of speechless because I, I know you guys, I, I heard you guys. I heard you. I heard all of you. I listened. We're back. You click that. There you go. It's pretty cool. You can, and there you go. You got all your cameras, your rear front aerial cargo we don't need to adjust the center line and then you get your side cameras and then you can like actually pan a little bit with them which is very cool yeah this truck, I mean, this truck has everything you got your uh, lane uh, sensors I, I never use it it's kind of weird I guess if you're on a highway and you're trailing that would be perfect Apparently they're offering this on all the trim levels now, which is kind of cool if you if you do trailer a lot. And we plan on trailering with this truck. We're, we are gonna get a car trailer so we can haul the Ruby Beast to different events. Oh, look at her. <laughs> look at her. I have to re-video this because all my uh, footage is lost because my microphone was popping and crackling and, oh, but I got you a special treat in the fridge. Oh my God, you're so gorgeous. I'd marry you again and again and again. The video when we actually picked up Beast Reloaded 3.0. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, that video. That um, sucks. Some of it, so we got some of the footage, but not, we lost a lot of footage. It was, it, the mic was popping and crackling. I love that you still have it on you right now. Oh. The mic was popping and crackling. Like, I already told them though. They know that. Oh. But I'm, I want to go over this truck. It's a brisk fall morning. I know, it's nice, isn't it? I want to go over this truck in detail. We went with the Ram boxes. Briefly started to talk about in the video before it went to crap. But uh, I'm excited because, you know, the reason I went with the Ram boxes. What? I just saw my reflection in this. Yeah. <laughs> the reason we went with the Ram. 
We're keeping it real, guys. I'm sorry, continue. Boxes. <laughs> the reason why we went the ram box is I found myself always lifting over top of the bed and scratching it. So now we're not going to do it. We're just going to scratch right here. <laughs> right, Chase, you're going to be buffing out here. We got to get it ceramic coated. I know, I know. But yeah, no more reaching over the bed. Yeah, you do lose some bed space back here, guys. But it's, you know, I, I don't really, uh, usually when we're putting stuff in the bed of the truck, it's usually suitcases and stuff like that. It's plenty of room for and suitcases. No. <laughs> uh -uh, no. No cookies are going here. What? Um, yeah. I'm so bed covers on the way to Joe from D'Ambrosia Auto Group where we got this truck. Yeah, I had a lot of footage with him. We lost all the footage with Joe, unfortunately. Oh no. Yeah, if you guys need a truck, make sure you hit him up. Get it ordered. I mean it only took what? Two we ordered this July twenty seventh. Here's the actual order sheet. July twenty seventh, and we got it literally like two weeks ago. So it didn't take long to build this. Came during from, a pandemic. Yeah, during a pandemic. Do you need any of the other paperwork that you gave me? Nah, I, well, I didn't want to wake you up. So that's got pretty much everything. We're going to do another video where we're actually going to go through everything, sort of like we did with that Rubicon review video that we did, the Gladiator. Because it's right by where my tree is. That's all right. We'll, we'll do it in another video. I just, I just want to, sh I want to show the viewers briefly of what Reloaded Beast Reloaded 3.0 looks like. Is this going to jump ahead of some videos? Because I know we're both. Yes, this is going to jump ahead. I can't wait because I've I been guess. posting it on social media. People will want to know. I'm getting all kinds of messages. Oh, but we nice. went with we went the Mega Cab guys. It's uh, it's plenty of room for the kids back here. These fold down. Again, I'm going to go through and make another video. You can actually recline these seats. We're, <laughs> we're going to go through and make plenty more videos. Don't you worry. Here's our 6.7 liter Cummins. And this truck in its stock form has 370 horsepower and 850 foot-pounds of torque with a towing capacity of almost 20,000 pounds. So in its stock form, that's where we're at. We're already doing some research with a uh, different cold air induction. Um, don't know if we're going to do an intake horn. Don't think we're going to do any deleting. Don't think we're going to do any tuning, but you never know. But at this point, yeah, we're, we're uh, it's in its stock form. It's probably going to stay this way for a while. Who are we quitting? I'm always doing stuff, so. <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm so stoked to have this truck yeah, camera there it's got the the paint match bumpers the sport appearance looking forward to sharing this build with all you guys and i'm sure you're excited to have a diesel back on the channel again i'm going to briefly and quickly just run down the order sheet the way this is total the priced out the way it sits list is seventy nine thousand three hundred ninety dollars so we're just gonna break it down. So we got the 2500 Mega Cab 4x4 Laramie. It's got the customer preferred package, the 2HH. We went with the, of course we went with the Cummins. It's got the 68 RFE transmission. We'll be doing some stuff to that. I guarantee you we will be doing some stuff to the transmission with Cheshire County Transmissions. Leather trim bucket seats, um, heated and cooled leather trim bucket seats. Uh, decal delete yeah we didn't want any uh, 4x4 decals on the side we do have some black emblems on the rear tailgate but I'm keeping them I don't think I'm gonna deep badge Laramie level 2 equipment group which again like I said all the bells and whistles that you can possibly think of the night edition that's the paint match bumpers um, you can get them in a few colors we didn't go black this time I'm really happy with the color that we chose they actually have like a billet it's like silver it looks really good too we were going back and forth between that but I think I picked the right color guys uh, the Ram box cargo management system which is really cool um, protection group 12 inch uh, Uconnect screen with navigation safety group and uh, towing technology group wanted to have that power deployable running boards worth every penny and then um, 5.5 additional gallons of diesel. I don't know what the hell that is. Easy order and sold vehicle, which was sold to Beast Projects. It was really cool. It's on the window sticker. So again, I'm going to go into detail, more detail on a later date with the missus and completely go over this truck from soup to nuts. And just having it for two weeks. I'm so excited to be back in a Ram diesel. So hope you guys. 
enjoyed this video, if you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're stopping by for the first time, make sure you smash tap, do something to that subscribe button. Turn, <laughs> turn on all those notifications. Really important you do that. Make sure you're sharing all the videos. Uh, check us out on social media. Go to allbeastprojects.com. That's me. That's our merch. Additional information on us. Some discount codes on there as well. Beastsynthetics.com. Again, that's me. And I'm an Amsoil dealer. When you purchase your Amsoil from me, it helps support the channel so I can continue to bring awesome content and do awesome things to these vehicles. We love you guys. We'll see you on the next upload.